Plan to a uh, hill session be a speed session, probably kilometer repeat, see how many I can do. Uh, probably just thinking of some hilly uh, spot in Kilbogo Park. So uh, I'm just about to uh, start the warm. So see. So I've done my uh, warm up here. It just uh, uh, took me about a uh, 1.2 miles to get to this point. So I ran a lap around here just to go around the pond and uh, up the path in the back here. It's a uh, one point. Uh, didn't say yet, but uh, it's a uh, one. Uh, it's point uh, three three of a, mi a kilometer or a mile. So that's just over half a. Kilometer. So for these kilometer repeats, I'll probably do uh, just under two laps here. So if I start here, I'll probably finish somewhere over there. So um, uh, yeah. So I'm just uh, gonna do some stretching, some strides. I'm lazy when it comes to stretching, but I always do them just for a session, just after the warm. So first up is a uh, lunge. I don't know what the hell this one's called, but uh, it's just like something like this, the uh, calf stretch. I don't know why I bother doing this shit, man. Okay, that's enough stretching, so it's time for a stride. <laughs> 50 meter stride. I'm counting the strides as my mileage, so that's why I'm using the watch. And uh, yeah, it's just like half like the full pitch is like 50 meters or something. It's good to get the strides in to work your fast twitch muscle fibers. Obviously, your slow twitch muscle fibers are more important, but uh, for distance order, but. You need to get that little bit of speed as well. All right, so it's just been like four uh, strides. So uh, I'm not going to uh, feel myself uh, running the actual intervals because you know I need to concentrate here. But uh, probably in the recoveries I will. I probably give myself two 200 meter recoveries in between. So if I'm able to talk, I'll talk. If I'm not able to talk, I won't talk. That's just if that happens, that just means I'm I'm knackered and I haven't really caught my breath back. So uh, that one went pretty well. This is my recovery right there. I think like, looking against the wind like 5 minute mile please, I was going down probably like 450, so that's yeah, alright. Uh, just uh, moving forward to the next one. I think I started off a little bit too fast. Uh, I've done four of them now. First two quick, thank you, slow down a bit. First two felt very comfortable, but uh, last two sort of felt tough, so I'm just taking a walking break, taking an extra recovery. It's all about flogging yourself, even in the sessions. Oh, man. Oh, you yeah, know, it's okay. Uh. She's going around today, man. Okay, the session is done. I've done eight by a kilometer there, just. You know, going up there. What did you do there? Uh, I, uh, here's a bit of advice. Uh, uh, if you're doing your first session back, like say you've been doing a long base building phase, like just like tempo runs and easy runs, then when you hit your first session, pop the repeats. Just start off relaxed. If anything, speed your way up. Cause I went backwards. I, uh, I was looking at my watch a lot there, telling me my uh, average pace and up. And I think I was for the first two, it was probably going about. 450 mile pace and then next four would probably be like 5, 505 and last two my legs just gave up on me and I was probably going like 520, 525 mile pace and it wasn't being heavy at all, it's just the legs were just too sore I guess that's the thing like my, I guess my road base probably like strong enough and this is natural so uh, like you probably feel the same way yourself if you do this but uh yeah it takes a bit of time to get that speed in uh uh, but like, you need that for the uh, the cross country races. Uh, you can't be doing like base building training all the time. <laughs> you have to be doing some bit of speed work, some bit of faster stuff, like what well, like what I was trying to do here. But uh, I gotta have a look at my watch a bit too much, to be honest. Uh, so uh, <laughs> found this uh, football there in the bushes. Uh, Cam Tilly, uh football club play here, so. Uh, I don't know what should I do. Should I kick the ball in there, or should I just uh, leave it there? Or... I, I don't know. Uh... Right, just kick it in there. Try to get it in. Yep. Got an extra ball when training starts. So I'm just cooling down. Uh, good 7:55 mile pace. 7:50. Ah, uh, good like cool down pace. Uh, so we have a little my I think I've already mentioned this. The eagle like ridiculously. So 
in the cool down like 10 minute mile pace I mean, yeah, it's meant to be easy like not like, that easy it's not meant to be walking and uh you know when you're doing your recoveries in between uh reps it shouldn't be too slow either like i was probably doing like eight minute once i got my watch i was going around like eight minute mile pace maybe 10 maybe Trade with work good, like you know, like so 16 for the 5k. <laughs> they go off like 14 minute mile pace, <laughs> it's ridiculous. They're walking, but they make it look like they're running because they use like destroyed or something. <laughs> so uh, I keep the ball in there earlier, and uh, yeah, still there, nice and protected. Nobody's gonna rob that ball, right? So uh, just finish up there. Uh, time to check the post box, see if you've got any post there. Uh, no, no. Oh, so I'm back in my boring old house, and uh, really, for people who uh, like um, who like crave to just be at home all day, uh, let me just tell you this: it can be really boring. There's uh, uh, not much going on really. It's not that exciting. I think you need to have somewhere to go during the day. I think uh, whether that be I don't know a job, uh, like some hobby, whether you get paid for it or not, or something like that. It's just Stepping in here now, it's like I don't, know, I don't know my watch on, but I think it's just after like half ten now. And, man, it's just so boring. I feel like I shouldn't be here. I feel like I should be somewhere else. Um, anyway, if you if you believe, if you agree with that, like what I'm any what I'm saying, uh, comment section below. Uh, what do you think? I don't get a lot of comments from you guys. I don't think you're watching to the end of my videos, but if you have watched to the end of this video, then thumbs up. Thank you for being so uh, patient and. Uh, uh, patience in running, you know, it takes a bit of time to uh, get yourself back to where you were if you're doing that long base building phase. I already mentioned this, really, so uh, just uh, just keep at it uh, and uh, just never give up.